Take a good look in the mirror. Tell me who, who do you see? Keep your head up. Reflect on who you are. Yeah, that's you, you. Bold as can be. Every feature on your face, your ears, your eyes, your nose, your teeth are as perfect as can be. So sing, I'm brave, I'm strong, I'm loved, I'm smart, and I'm you. Welcome back for another episode of Moments with Miss McGrew. Can you believe that it's December already? With December come many magical celebrations that I'm sure that you and I are looking forward to. But in December, it's easy to get very busy and to concentrate on doing so many things that we can end up feeling a little bit burnt out and we can actually take some of the joy and the magic out of the holidays by forgetting to take time for self-care. So this December, we are going to be taking some moments to pause and focus on taking care of ourselves. So today I want to share with you some simple tips to make sure that this holiday truly is a joyous one for you and that we avoid burning ourselves out. So the first thing that I want to share with you is it's okay to not feel super happy and excited and wonderful all the time. While we want the holidays to be a joyful season, it's also a season of remembrance. It's a season of looking back. And many of us have gone through some difficult times in the last year. It's okay to embrace those feelings. So your first permission to yourself in order to help you to care for yourself the way that you deserve to be cared for is give yourself permission to feel. Whatever you are feeling is valid and has purpose. Take time to acknowledge your feelings. In fact, I encourage you, as we've practiced so many times, to write it out. Write down how you're feeling. Take a moment. Draw it out. Create. Put your feelings into something that channels them into an outlet. Because if we hold them all in, we end up like that soda can that is shaken up until we explode. So first and foremost, in caring for yourself, remember, your feelings are valid. It is okay to feel. 
The second tip I'm going to share with us today for self-care is to remember not to get so busy that you forget to take care of yourself. It's important that we take time to pause. Alone time is good and valuable. We're spending a lot of time with friends and family and getting back into the routines of going back to school and being able to see people that we love and have missed. But don't fill your calendar so much that you don't have just a few moments, even if it's one or two moments when you first wake up, to stretch and do something you enjoy. Or in the evening, before you turn on the TV, to pause and do a hobby that you enjoy. Take a few minutes intentionally. Challenge yourself this week. Set aside at least five. Five. We've all got five minutes somewhere. Five minutes to do one thing you really enjoy. What could that thing be that you enjoy, that's special to you? For me, I am gonna go home and I'm gonna work on some crafts. I love crafting, it brings me joy, it helps me to relax my mind, to focus on being present. Maybe for you it's reading or singing. Maybe it's even dancing in your living room. But today's self-care challenge is to take just five minutes to set aside time for you. Remember, in this holiday season, it is so important that we take time to take care of ourselves so that we can truly celebrate together. Well, friends, I have enjoyed our time together today. I hope that you have learned something valuable. I know that I feel challenged and I am going to go and work on making sure I take some time for myself. Thank you for being here and I look forward to our time together again soon here on Moments with Miss McGrew. Until next time.